what percentage is 45 milliliters of 220 milliliters? This means that a percentage time 220, which give me 45. So now we want to work out what percentage it is. So to do this, this is just like equation. So if I divide by 220, I divide by 220 like this, this cancel out. So we can find out what this one is. So this one is just a fraction. So if you simplify that, divide by five, that give me nine, five, 22 divided by five is four, remainder two, and then divide by five, give me four. But this is in term of fractions. So we want in term of percentage, remember? So we want percentage, we time by 100%. So I just use calculator and type that exactly these numbers in the calculator, which give me 20 and 511%. That's how you do it. The easiest way to do, let me clear this first. All we need to do is just go 45 over 220 times by 100%. So which is 45 over 220 and I time by 100%. So just time by 100. So which give me 225 over 11. I just go SD button, give me decimal point. I don't want that. I just go shift SD. That will give me mixed numeral. So the answer is equal to 20 and 5 over 11%. Express 4 grams as a percentage of 25 grams. So all we need to do is 4 out of 25. And because I want percentage, it's just time by 100. But 100%, okay? So that's all. I know that 25 go to 100 is 4 times. So 4 times 4 is 16. So 16 percent. Otherwise, just use your calculator. So I just bring this on this side so I can see the see the numbers. So all you need to do is four divided by twenty-five or four over twenty-five, same thing. I just time by hundred. So which is sixteen. So sixteen percent. Please stop the video and try this one yourself. So the first one, what percentage is forty-two kilometers of one hundred and twenty kilometers? So remember, we just use 42 kilometers, they're all same units now, so we don't have to convert anything. So it just go 42 over 120 times by 100%. So which equal to 42 divided by 120 times by 100. So which is 35%. So equal to 35%. Now just remember to interpret these questions. What it means is this. What percentage is 42 kilometers of 120 kilometers? It means that a percentage time by 120 will give me 42. That's what it means. So if you divide by 120, divide by 120 on here, this is give me fractions, but I want in term of percentage all I need to do, I just time by 100%. That's all. So that's how you interpret the question. Question number two, what percentage is six hours of 24 hours? So all you need to do is just six hours over 24 hours. That is fractions, but we want in term of percentage, you just time by 100%. So which equal to, so I just bring a calculator up first. So which is 6 over 24. But if you notice, you can divide by 6, give me 1. Divide by 6, give me 4. A quarter. A quarter is 25%. Otherwise, you just put that in a calculator. Over 24 times by 100. So which is 25%. So 25%. Express 
the first quantity as a percentage of the second 60 milliliters and 90 milliliters so all we need to do is we just go 60 over 90 times by a hundred percent because we want percentage so I can just go this zero cancel out and then um, six you can divide by three give me two divide by three give me three this means that 200 over three so 200 percent over three so which is equal to three go to 21 is six times remainder two three go to 20 is six times because six times three is 18 remainder two so which is two third percent otherwise just use your calculator so let's work that out so 60 over 90 otherwise just do this nothing wrong with that okay so time by 100 of course if you can do without calculator that'd be great otherwise just use calculator so this is it 40 seconds and 1.5 minutes so seconds minutes so therefore you have to convert minute to second first so all I need to do is time by 60 because it's one minute is 60 seconds otherwise you know that one minute is 60 second half of minute is 30 seconds so you add them up give me 90 seconds otherwise again just use calculator and then 1.5 times 60 give you the answer I know that this is 90 seconds all I need to do now is 45 out of 90 and then time by a hundred percent because because we want percentage so you know that this is a half and then a half is 50 percent otherwise just go 45 over 90 time by 100 so give me 50 percent let me clear this first 60 centimeters and three meters three meters we need to convert that into centimeters first now three meters is 300 centimeters because one meter is a hundred centimeters now, if you cannot remember this chart will help you to convert kilometers to meters and millimeters and so on so kilometers followed by kilometers will be meters after meters centimeters followed by millimeters so please remember this order so from here to here you time by a thousand and then from here to here one zero less so just keep that in mind so time hundred and then one zero less which is ten so you time those but if you come backward you divide by ten you divide this by a hundred and then you divide this by a thousand so that's all from three meters to centimeters so I just time by hundred from here to here see there you go three times a hundred three hundred so now what we need to do is just 60 over 300 time by a hundred percent so what you can do is you can do manually or use your calculator so if I ignore this a hundred let's say I ignore this hundred percent that cancel out then 6 divided by 6 is 1 3 divided by 30 is 5 so 1 fifth is 20 percent otherwise you just go 100 divided by 5 it still give me 20 so 20 percent or you just use calculator put them all in it's all about the process so the answer is 20 percent 12 hours and two days so this is hours this is days so we need to convert day into hours first so one day equal 24 hours so one day equal 24 hours so therefore which is time by 24 so 2 times 24 is 48 so 48 hours so therefore all we need to do is we just go 12 over 48 that is fractions but we want in term of percentage so what we do we time by a hundred percent so just time by a hundred percent so all we need to do is just put in calculator or you can do do it um, manually so you can divide both by by 12 give me one divide by 12 give me four one over four is a quarter a quarter 25 percent if you like uh, otherwise just put everything in the calculator so 25 percent please stop the video and try this one yourself 
First one, 80 cents and a dollar fifty. So first of all, this is 80 cents and this is dollars. So we need to convert this a dollar fifty cents to cents first. So that become a hundred and fifty cents. So now what we need to do is just go eighty over one fifty and you time by a hundred percent. So which give me fifty three and one third percent. So fifty three and one third percent. So now eighteen months and one point five years. One year is twelve months. So one point five you just time by twelve. Otherwise, one year is 12 months and half of year is 6 months. You add them up, it's 18 months, if you like. So I just write shortcut, write 18 months first. So what I do now, I just go 8 over 18, time by 100%. So I can simplify 8, I can divide by 2, give me 4, and 18 divided by 2, that give me 9. So which is 4 times 100 divided by 9. So which is 400 divided by 9. So 9 go to 40 is 4 times. Because 4 times 9 is 36. So remember 4. 9 go to 40 again, which is give me 4, which remember 4. So the answer is 44 and 49. Otherwise, just type this in your calculator. So it's, it's all about the process. So which is, give me 44 and 49 percent. Percent. 700 grams and 1.2 kilograms. So again, 1.2 kilograms. So one kilogram is a thousand grams. So I time by thousand first. So what I do, I move this one, become 12, cancel this, 12 times 100 is 1,200 grams. So now all I need to do is 700 grams over 1,200 grams. And I time by a hundred, of course, hundred percent. So these two cancel with this. So now become seven hundred divided by twelve. So seven hundred divided by twelve, which give me fifty-eight and one third percent. Or you can write fifty-eight point three recurring percent. But mixed numeral is better. That's all. Seven hundred milligrams, one point two grams. So again, this one, all I need to do, I time by 1,000 to convert to milligrams. So which is move 1, so which means 12 times 100, which is 1,200 milligrams. 700 divided by 1,200 times by 100%. So same answer is above because exactly the same numbers. So I just write that down. 58 and 1 third. Thank you so much for watching.